raise awareness mm -hmm. and, and to be able to, to encourage as many women as possible to join into this beneficial uh, initiative. The United Nations Entity for Gender Equality and the Empowerment of Women and Stanbic Bank Uganda have signed a memorandum of understanding to promote gender equality in the country. Yeah, it might take us more than 200 years no. to achieve gender equality. The gap is still there. Oh, no. So there is a financial gap and everything. So it's really an opportune time to have this. And I'm really glad that there are two SDGs that uh, we are fo focusing among others. SDG 5 for gender equality and SDG 8, re, uh, decent work and economic growth as envisioned uh, on uh, Agenda 2030. So the Memorandum of Understanding for the initiative has been signed by UN Women Country Representative Dr. Paulina Chiwango and Stanbic Bank Chief Executive Officer Anne Juko at Stanbic Bank Head Office in Kampala. Juko says through its specialized women banking unit, Stand big for her and the partnership seeks to advance women-led enterprises in Uganda and eventually contribute to the achieving the desired global gender parity in the business. We are especially pleased today to be partnering with you and women because, <coughs> first of all, you're already doing, this is the work you're doing already, right? So to have a powerful partner is to, to further put the wind beneath our wings so that we can fly higher. We have a, a big envelope. For, for the women in this country and we want to continue to do this as we go along. So I'm quite pleased that, that today we are inking that agreement. And the UN Women Representative in Uganda, Dr. Paulina Chiwanga, says it's important to promote active participation of individuals and groups outside the public sector, such as civil society and the private sector, in the promotion of gender equality and the empowerment of women. So, and we know um, gender equality, SDG 5, is the linchpin for achieving all other uh, SDGs, all That's the 17 goals. So, it's really, I'm really, really delighted to be here today to witness this day, but also to sign this agreement. So, Stanbic Bank Uganda Country Head of Credit, Muchai Gladys, says, the initiative would unlock the potential in women-led enterprises so that they perform better. So I would say $15 million is the initial ticket um, for this, but then obviously with a whole lot of scale. In its fullness, what we, what we aspire to, because as you realize, it, it's a step-by-step -step <coughs> program. In its fullness, we want to get this fund to $100 million. And we've said this for, for the SACO fund as well as this fund. But for, it's a step-by-step -step journey that we are taking and so far the results are very good. The three-year yeah. partnership aims at building the capacity of women entrepreneurs in financial and business management value chain, marketing access and improving women's access to affordable credit. We're calling for collateral but uh, we'll rely heavily on the level of transactability 